Well, as the fans know, the Orioles organization and their players are very committed in the community. And on the last homestand, Kevin Millwood got a chance to ride along with the Baltimore City Police Department to experience what it is like to be a policeman or a policewoman in the city of Baltimore. Well, on this homestand, it is Brian Mattis' turn. Mattis had a chance to ride around with the Baltimore City Fire Department to experience what it's like in the day in the life of someone who lives to save others. He rode around with Truck 4 or Truck 29 Engine 4 Firehouse. Let's We'll take a look now at Brian Mattis and his excellent adventure. Hi, I'm Brian Mattis, Orioles left-handed pitcher. And if I wasn't towing the rubber every fifth day, growing up I always wanted to be a fighter fighter. So I'm uh, going to spend the day here with some firemen and firewomen and uh, go through the day, day in the life of being a firefighter. So who drives the truck? You're the driver? Okay, this is not a truck. This engine. is a fire engine. engine. It carries water. Sorry. That's a fire truck. It okay. carries ladders. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> so you're on call right now. If you were to get a call, you could just be like, all right, we're yep. going. We go, yep. You're right now, that thing goes off. It'll sound like emergency tones if you you don't know that show, but you remember that show Emergency? Yes. 51, baby. yes. <laughs> so that that that'll be the sound this computer makes and that'll be us. Right. We're on that call, whatever it is. Alright. What's that? The other way, you're taking it oh, off. Oh, yeah. Other way. Definitely don't want me running the show. We're ready? Charge it. All right. Am I gonna... Keep going, keep going. Keep going. Engine 53, engine 30, engine 36. Stand behind the hydrant, stand behind the hydrant, keep going. Behind it? Okay. Oh man. Tire. It's my conditioning for today. Where am I holding right. it? You're gonna, you're gonna hold the hose, right? And you're gonna hold this thing and you're gonna pull this thing back. Okay, like, is that what releases now, the water? Yeah. Now, I'm now, left-handed, so. Now, I don't care how you hold it, but look. Get yourself a firm stance, okay? okay. Is this gonna be a lot and of? when you open it, open it slow, okay? Okay, is this gonna be a lot of pressure? Whoa, watch out. <laughs> Keep going with it. That adjusts. What? I'm kind of just messing around with this. Okay. I don't know. Is it shooting? <laughs> that thing's heavy. Oh my god. Well, as you can see, I'm sweating a lot right now. Pretty hot. And it's, uh, it's not even a hot day, it's actually pretty chilly out and uh, sweating, sweating pretty good. But uh, just went through a whole series of leading off with the hose, uh, hooking it up. It's really not as easy as it looks when you have tons of gear on, you have the gloves where you can't even feel what you're doing. And then uh, 
and then holding the hose with 80 pounds of, I think it was about 80 pounds of pressure shooting through that hose, it was pretty heavy. But um, it was a good day and all we did was hook up a hose and, and let it ride a little bit and I'm already worn out. <laughs>